Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena absolutely picture perfect for a game of this nature they've got on the way here pretty promptly Bruno Fernandes Laxalt does well to read it and intercepts gets it upfield One. Good first touch and almost as good a second. Fabian Ruiz brilliantly took control of that, which was exactly what the situation required. And it's played forward. It did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. Kenny. And Dyke. Pablo Sarabia. Bruno Fernandes. Tries lifting it up. Has a pop! Goal! Bayern Munich! The breakthrough strike! Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Bayern Munich take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Tries to get it forward quickly. Just brushed off the ball there. And Dyke did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. And try from distance. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Laxalt demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Forward it goes. Into the final five minutes of the first half. Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. Oh, good interception. Hoists it forward, and Dyke cuts it out. Collar. It's Pablo Sarabia. And that'll be the last act of the first half. So there you have it, a close fourth half of football. Still had its moments, and ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up to me. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Well, when you look at the both in quality, the gap should be greater, but there are higher gears to be found, so maybe we'll see that reflected. Bayern Munich leading 1-0 at the break. So we're just settling back into this second half. Bayern Munich carrying a one-goal lead. Got a shot away! He's pulled off a fine save! Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. Good save, he got a decent fist on that. 
Wolves out on the left now. He's pinged one through here. Adama Traore keeps everyone guessing. Bruno Fernandes. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Little doubt, that is a foul. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Tries a header! Oh, not the best of headers. And Dyke. Rudiger takes the long option. Laxalt is there and he can get that clear. Knocks it away. He hits it. So far, Jim? Well, it's a natural instinct to defend when ahead, but it's too early for them to settle into that practice just now. Good take, and he's had a look. Shot at goal! Celtic showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Well, Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. Fabian Ruiz. Collar. Tries to get it forward quickly. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Kenny to locate someone up front. Chip through. That intervention was very necessary. Celtic have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. Questions were asked. And he's given the answers. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. So that's it, it is all over. What a game. End to end, it flew by.